So within CERNER, my title is Chief Health Information Officer. I often tell people I'm mainly a troublemaker, but what I focus on is innovation, bringing knowledge or intelligence into the systems, making them more than just the bean counting systems that they often started out as, and then trying to engage clinicians and others in improving the safety and usability of the systems. Well, health informatics is obviously a very broad field and uh, lots of specialization, lots of people focusing in different areas. One of my personal passions really is focusing on how to bring intelligence mm -hmm. into systems, how to make documentation tools which don't take more time as they do today, how to make sure that physicians and patients are supported in their decision making by good information and good data. Well, the open innovation aspect of the Digital Health Assembly, the tagline for the conference, is, is really relevant for me. As I said, one of the things that I'm responsible for at Cerner is innovation within the organization. And that doesn't just mean going out and creating wild and crazy things. That means things like how do we build uh, a culture among the engineering staff that is looking at uh, uh, ways to work not just as engineers, but with their healthcare peers, with their knowledge-based peers, and so on to really make serious contributions to the field. But I think open innovation is even more than that. It's, it's opening up beyond the organizational walls. And this conference is a great example. The Digital Health Assembly has really brought people, many without a medical background, but a big data background or with a innovation background and, and having those discussions about how do those concepts apply have been really helpful. So I think as we apply some of these notions and, and directions in the next year, that, that where we'll really see progress is in small ways. It's, it's not going to be revolutionary, it's going to be evolutionary change. And what I hope we see is that many of the systems that have been deployed, pushed, uh, foisted upon clinicians will really start to fulfill their promise of improving the quality of care and improving the safety of the care that patients receive and not just uh, helping with the bookkeeping as it were, which is where most of the systems are today. As we look forward, uh, you know, think about uh, digital health and, and the opportunities there, I think we'll continue to have discussions about the quantified self, about individual level devices, and, and we'll have more information and experience there. That'll be one of the topics that I think will be quite prominent.